هاوس تو هاوس فروم لبر he had two oh, houses died. but now there is nothing for them now <laughs> just what the clothes what they were wearing they had to flee ICS came and it was announced that all the people should leave or uh, you should become muslims or they have to pay taxes or they will be killed when the crisis of isis start our people came set settled inside the church inside the gardens so me and some of my colleagues we thought we have to have a health care for these people so just we started in this caravan at saint joseph charity clinic the people who are treating here are all idps It means the internally displaced people so we are treating christian muslims yazidi without any exception 100 to 150 patients a day the cases differs according to the season despite all this we have some cases belonging to stressful condition she's complaining of muscle pain and neck pain but uh, from her uh, face you will look in anxiety most of the people if you ask them what's your sickness sometimes they'll tell you i don't know it's my head it's my shoulder it's my back pain it's it's my sugar it's my blood pressure they used to have their jobs they used to have their own houses they used to have their own cars they used to have their own life now they lost each and everything and percent of these people are mentally depressed it's the reason of stress and the stress will change to different types of diseases till now we have 2800 chronic patients who receiving from us chronic medicine on monthly basis as we are the only center to dispense for uh, these idps refugee uh, the chronic medicine the now they are poor depending on the mercy of people who help them and especially for these medications it is very expensive and for the chronic medication alone we spend about 40 to 45000 dollar per month the staff here all are volunteer but if we don't have medicine we cannot provide anything for the patient Holy Spirit working through people that's why I want to thank all benefactors and the people who are supporting us a special thank for the Holy Father Pope Francis for his prayer for the all IDPs for his support as a amount of budget for the clinic in order to continue in our mission for providing the chronic medicine for the patients Good morning your holiness. Thank you very much for the gifts which we have received through your pontifical uh, charity organization Aid to the Church in Need which was dedicated to buy medicine for the Christian IDPs in Iraq especially in Erbil. Thank you very much. You always ask us to pray for you. We pray for you and we ask you to pray for us. Thanks again. Bismillah.